The suspect accused of shooting and killing a man outside a Southwest Valley gas station refused to appear in court. We're talking about 22-year-old Jesus Javier Uribe. He was taken into custody yesterday from a home near the crime scene. Joe Muller is there now live with the latest. Joe. This gas station behind me here was closed much of yesterday, but it is now back open. Now that suspect who allegedly shot and killed someone here in this parking lot ended up not being in court. He refused to come to court, Your Honor. He refused, okay. Jesus Javier Uribe is accused of randomly walking into a gas station early Thursday morning, robbing one person before shooting and killing another. While people in the area were on edge knowing he was not behind bars, several hours later, police got a tip he was in a nearby home and a barricade situation started. Uribe was taken into custody without incident. He was set to face a judge Friday for a number of charges, including murder and attempted murder. A friend of the victim, Curtis Abraham, showed up to court to face the suspect. Yeah, I think he's disgusting and um, vile, and um, and he needs to be put away forever. He took Curtis's life, and Curtis was loved by many people. As you can imagine, neighbors who live around here feel a lot better knowing the suspect is behind bars. But one woman we spoke to today says she still has a lot of questions, and the suspect is due back in court on Tuesday. Reporting live, Joe Moeller, live from Local Now. Thank you, Joe. And the family of the victim, Curtis Abraham, released this statement saying in part, quote, our family is broken, our hearts are broken. Words cannot explain the pain and anger we feel. Curtis was a father, son, grandson, brother, beloved family member, and friend. We will hold strong that the justice system will prove that this monster knowingly left his home in tactical gear armed with the intent to kill the innocent. We will grieve his loss forever. We have the full statement on 8newsnow.com.